All right, let's get into it. How come our round ones are always jokers? Um, it's joker players. It's, it, it simply <laughs> must be that way. Yeah, because they're optimistic, that's why they don't make it that round one. Uh, okay, but we're like, well, we got a uh, Joker and Sonic Paragon on FD. Hey, last surprise, hey. Yeah. Yeah, and uh, yeah, I'm not surprised that this is the first stage that was fixed this matchup. Right, Sega. Yeah, it's yeah. gonna be a little, a little new shit playing over here. A little bust in the It's FD. Not, not much you can, you can go anywhere here. Yeah, and 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 already you're you're seeing um, seeing move set up, you know, set up the edge play against uh, Kamek. This is gonna be pretty big against Sonic, because uh, especially on a uh, stage like FD, where Joker's gonna want to corner Sonic, we're gonna see how much uh, how far you can push the edge play right now. Yeah. Sonic knows what he's doing. He just goes up, hits some buttons, and whenever that was just do the homing attack. The game plan. Yeah. And already we're seeing, a, we're seeing a lot of homing attacks coming out from Kamek. She already hit um, uh, a couple times with this homing attack. Ooh, and that's uh, nice. Oh, too deep. Oh, gets thrown. Yeah. Yeah, and they're, and they're both definitely about the violence right now, about the action. Yeah, I'll switch that shield to punish that uh, down air. Yeah. The uh, mood trying to get his, his, his best friend, Arsene, in the back. Yeah, and good stuff by Kamex taking that taking that stock with Ultimate Shadow Shield. We, we actually you don't actually see it a lot out of the Sonics. You don't see a lot of Ultimate Shadow Shield, but it's generally like an okay option. You know, you get hit with something laggy. Yeah, that was very laggy coming from the Joker of all things like down there. Right. And Kamex being really aggressive against Moot right now, and um, yeah, Moot countering. Cause he's gotten hit with a lot of these spin dashes and uh... And Kamek has been dragging them left and right across the stage uh, each and every time, so... Musa hasn't even been able to get stage position. Yeah, Kamek's doing a good job. Ooh, that was a good dodge! <laughs> yeah, Kamek's doing a good job of, of the hit and run, punishing when uh, Musa whips. And yeah. the forward tilt's gonna take that stock. It's us. Yeah. Yeah, but Kamex at 200%. And I'm pretty sure Moot hasn't even been able to use Arsene that much in this matchup because Kamex has essentially run out the clock every time Moot has gotten uh, Arsene, so. Not really getting the Arsene hits, which is very crucial for Jokers to land in order to take yeah. stocks very fast. <laughs> Forward hit. Back here, okay. Yeah. He's catching a lot of these jumps out of the corner. Yeah, I'm liking what, Kam what uh, Kamex is doing here just to keep the pressure going against Moot. Because you don't want to get like your opponent time to relax. That was a good uh, homing attack. I thought I was gonna like whiff and then watch him dive mm. for it, <laughs> like it usually does for Sonic. But I guess it's good. Oh, yeah. Minecraft punch. Yep, that two friends. Yeah, and that and that's something that um, Sonic's uh, definitely have against Joker in this matchup. Joker in Arsene is has a very predictable recovery where the time you can't really vary the timing that much, and uh, Sonic's big fist is. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it, it's very easy to catch people on the ledge. It's very easy to time in those situations. So, all right, down throw. He do be swinging. Nice, nice, good recovery. Oh, okay, you're not dead. You're good. You're good. You're fine. Wow, and that early upbeat, that was great awareness. Then, yeah, Kamex probably should have backed off there because they were a little too close to the ledge. One back there was all they needed to take. Maybe a little bit too close to the ledge. Yeah. Kamex can close this out. They're, they've been taking the lead most of these percentages, but Moot can get one good Arsene time and get and hit him like two hits and like kill him. Yeah, that's probably the first time we saw Moot actually use Arsene to the full extent. Ooh, what a nice control. Yep, but yeah. forward air there that they went for constantly throughout the whole set. Off stage works. <laughs> yeah. that's the end. And that's right when it mattered, too. Nice. Yeah. And that's not something Kamex was trying to scout out earlier. Uh, Kamex was trying to scout out the low recoveries coming out from Moot, but didn't really, didn't really see anything that he liked. And that was the time that he said, okay, I got you. Scouted out before, and now I'm comfortable. And I want to take that game one. Sorry, sorry about that. Okay, so. 
Mood probably needs to find like gaps in mechanics especially over here just to see if they can avoid whatever whatever damage and setups that Camax is going for. Like this forward air is off stage were very scary. Mm -hmm. And they were doing a good job of avoiding them throughout the whole set. It's just like the last one happened to matter to kill them. That forward smash is very dangerous on the ledge. You gotta watch how you recover. Uh, our scene our scene management is also important too. You wanna make your RC time matter as Joker, because you wanna like you just wanna use that <laughs> and help kill mm -hmm. him. Yeah. Yeah, and also uh I just feel like Moot needs to control the pace a little bit better. Uh it looks it seems like he got caught up a little bit too much in the match. And was uh, running a line for a bunch of comics and stuff, and as we say that <laughs> Yeah, the Queen of Wi-Fi over here. <laughs> Yeah, uh, this is definitely change of pace. Um, I, I think I actually do think a lot of the game was lost at the ledge, and a lot of and uh, it was due to Kamex kind of speeding it up. And maybe this could be a change of pace that um, needs. Yeah, this makes sense. As it's like, all right, so we're gonna fight at the ledge a lot, right? Might as well pick the character that does that the best. We fit, <laughs> and she definitely does do that. See, Kamex will go to the ledge as they're building up this suddenly. Oh, that punch. Yeah, but what we're seeing right now, once again, Camus is controlling the pace. Moot's trying to be a little bit more aggressive than he was before, but, uh, you know, right now... Uh, Not even a touch on Camus right now. Like, the game didn't even start for him. But... Yeah. Okay, bro. Camus is doing a really good job. In maintaining this lead. What a trade. Yeah. I mean, and... What a clash, sorry. Oh! Imagine oh, no. if you go out the wrong way. Ooh, oh, oh. oh no. Ooh, this is bad. Yeah, good recover. call. You don't want to land too fast against the Sonic because it's sitting there waiting for you. And they anti you. Alright. Catch a landing or two. No, he is pressing buttons. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they, 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 like he's lucky he's Sonic and that's not getting him killed, but imagine if he was like a space team he's doing that. <laughs> oh my god, it, it just seems... Oh man, it just seems like Moot's being like really passive. Um, oh! Five days needs to be and Would that be... <laughs> after I see that? That wasn't even deep breathing. Okay, that kills. Alright. They're just killing each other. It's even. Yeah. Kamex kind of messes up on their, on their invisibility platform neutral. Let's grab yeah. for it. it. Takes a 25, but Ants is right back. Oh! Ooh, yeah, you yeah, yeah, for it. Yeah, and I'm not seeing a lot of deep breathing coming out from Moot either. Uh, no deep breathing. I'm not seeing any sun. I know in this matchup, uh, Salute the Sun is actually pretty important to keep Sonic at bay. We won't see a lot of these approaches coming out from Kamex. Have much, uh, oh. have much at least throw out a projectile. I don't know, it was crazy. Yeah, yeah. It, was it kind of feels like Moody just with their counter pick character more than their main. They're not like keying up to uh, doing uh, Wii Fit's usuals. Mm -hmm. Like, usually you'd see the sun salutations or the, or the deep breathing by now just to help fight. But. I guess yeah. they're just trying to outbox uh, Kamex right now, which Kamex is just running away with right now. They're up two stocks, sitting comfortably a high percent. Yeah, it seems more like a counterfeit character than a counterfeit strategy. Because right now, I feel like he needed the counterfeit strategy of the Wii Fit more than the character itself. Mm. And right now, we he was better off just saying Joker if he wasn't going to use the counter oh, strategy. Oh, that's death. As, yep. Yeah. That's exactly it. Kamex takes a comfort to 2-0. Do you know how messed up that confirm is? Yeah, like, I know. It's crazy. It's like... Imagine just getting hit by just like Reed's uh, uh, spin move, right? It just, it just catches your, your at the ledge, and then he just confirms off that into the blast zone. Wow, you're dead. Crazy, huh? You it's not even that. It, can, <laughs> like, it confirms all the way up until like 130, 40, 50%. Uh, I, I, like, I want to say that confirm almost never stops working. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I, I see like Sonic do that at uh, higher levels. It's a really good tool to have. Um, yeah, Kamek takes that set with, with that with that tool. Disgusting. It's disgusting. Yeah. <laughs> wouldn't wouldn't pass Sakurai uh, on that. What's what are you gonna do? It's like 80 characters in the game. <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah. Um, okay.